What is up, Stitches? How we doing? Have y'all been? All right, so today it is Works in Progress Wednesday. I'm going to go through and show you guys stuff that I have made and stuff that I'm working on. First, I did this. This is actually from a tutorial by Nessa's Knots. It is a coffin-shaped coaster. Super cute, super goth, yas. I made this beanie with my knitting machine. The yarn is hand-dyed yarn from Speckled Finch Studios. The pom-pom is from K&C from Joann's. I got a 22 needle set trebuchet as well. And with that, I'm working on making socks. So I've made two pairs of socks. This is my first pair that I made. This is single strand with the 22 needle hook with the 22 needle machine they're comfy but they were kind of on the thin side which is why i did the second pair these are double strands so basically i literally took one i took a piece from each end of the yarn and put it through the machine together these are thicker they're actually really nice really freaking warm I'm obsessed. The yarn is from Hobie. It is two years ago Halloween yarn that I bought off of Whatnot from Alt Knots. Hey Kayla, what's up? Love you. All right. <clears throat> I finished this beautiful shawl. I'm kind of hanging it to try to block it because I don't have any pins for my blocking boards at the moment, but um, this I actually got the yarn for that at a local yarn store here in the town I live in. Owned by the cutest little old lady. She's so freaking sweet. I love her. Um, let's see. I made... Let me come over and show you. I made this. It is made with seven skeins of Bernat Blanket Big. It is actually for my niece for her bed because the big, big one that I made with 11 skeins for her last year, her brother stole. So I used what I had and I've made that for her. She said, oh, I'll basically just use it at the end of my bed. But she's like, thank you. It's really cute. Hold on. Need a sip. Cran apple juice. So good. Now I am working on this. This. I've been crocheting for over 20 years. This is literally the first time I have ever done a chevron blanket. The yarn, unfortunately it is discontinued. This is the Karen Spice Cakes. The color for this is Indiegogo. The pattern is actually from Yarnspirations. Hold on, I'm looking so I can tell you what the pattern's called. Okay, it is called the Karen Wavy Blank Wavy Granny Blanket. You can get it off of yarnspirations.com. It is one of their free patterns. But that's the picture of what it's going to look like when I'm done. I'm actually enjoying doing this a lot. I have another shawl that I'm working on, but that's in the car because, hi, I'm a trash panda. I have projects that I work on in the home, and I have projects that I work on in my car because I do DoorDash. So, yeah. Um, also, although I have not worked on it much this week, and I'm still only in March. No, I'm in April actually now working on it. But this is my temperature blanket for 2023. I'm doing it as corner to corner. I'm doing six blocks per day because I figured that way it would actually, you know, keep it at a manageable size. So here's hoping that works. Um, yeah, I'm kind of getting tongue tied. Don't really know what the hell to say. So, all right. I appreciate you guys being here. 
I love you all very much. I am also on TikTok, which is Ms. Bethy Page. I have an Etsy, which I will link below. Thank you for watching, guys. I appreciate you so much, and keep on stitching.